folks, just pulled off the side of the case here. You see the Antec 900. Look at the innards here. I've got the Corsair 750 watt. Uh, let's see here, I've got Sly 560 ties. One is the Crisis Edition. Let's see here, i got the Sabertooth, the Zeus motherboard. It's got ceramic coating on all their heat sinks and whatnot. It's pretty cool. I've got 12 gigabytes of XMS DDR3, a triple channel uh, RAM in there. I've got the Corsair H60. I added on an extra fan, so we got the push pull setup going on here. It's nice and cool. It's an i7 920. You got it overclocked over to 4 gigahertz. So it's a pretty good jump on the 2.6. Got a couple 2 terabyte drives in there. I'll say that. Got a 1 terabyte drive in between. I've got two DVD burners. In between, I've got a 500 gigabyte SATA drive that I use for the operating system. I'm going to be throwing in an SSD here pretty soon. Not sure when. Not much room in this case though. It's Antec 900 worse on cable management. Absolute worst. Had to drill a couple holes in here with a hole saw. Horrible. Had to go in through the back with some most of the wiring. And as you can see there, it's got the big standard case there. Big old huge fan up top here. Try for throwing down your cell phone at land parties. SATA, or I'm sorry, FireWire, two USBs, power, reset, etc. In front, there's the two drives. Two drives, a bunch of fans. It's ready to go. Getting ready to turn this baby back on. Just messing around with my fans and whatnot. Alright, folks, comment. Have a good time.